Well, I started Pembury after a chance meeting with a, uh, a chap in a, uh, on holiday. Um, and he had a, a bike and he would throw uh, about three pairs of pedals away each year. He'd smash them up and throw them away. And I knew that that was not the way we, we needed to be um, taking things forward. So I, I started Pembury um, with a view to controlling the whole life cycle of a product, you know, how it was designed, how it's manufactured how it's used and ultimately how it's recycled. Um, the, the, the materials that we choose um, in our products are hugely important. Um, some of the materials that are used in the industry are not recyclable, they're not good for the environment and cannot um, uh, be used, they shouldn't be used going forward. Um, and I, I feel that um, I started Pembury to make amazing products, um, to make products that were um, highly performing and that ultimately you didn't cost the earth and that's what I, I see our, our main primary goal is for the pandemic. Phil, we're here at your company. Can you tell us a little bit about it, please? Well, we're Pembury um, and we make mountain bike components in, in East Sussex in, in England. What particular components? Um, so we started off with a, two flat pedals um, with some investment in machinery. We've been able to increase our capacity and now we've started um, we've just brought out a seat post clamp and we're just about to launch a, a brand new stem so why bike components um it's uh, it's always been a passion of mine i was uh, bmx racing when i was a, a, a kid um, and i went into my teenage years i started to do downhill mountain biking um, at university i studied um, product design on my final year um, project I did, I, I designed a, a pedal which used magnets to, to secure the rider's foot to the, to the pedal. And there's a number of component manufacturers here in the UK in this sort of market. What's making you different? Um, I, I think the, the approach to the manufacturing, um, we are a completely transparent company. So all of our suppliers, all of the um, locations of where things are um, sourced from are on our website. Um, we are a totally carbon neutral company um, and I think we take a, a slightly different approach to how we design and ultimately manufacture and then recycle those products at the at the end of their useful life. In the terms of your software provider we have for Autodesk and I know you use Fusion 360. How has that helped the business? Um, it, it started before I even started um, uh, Pembury. Um, I, I started to um, uh, flesh out some ideas on Fusion 360 um, looked at the practical applications mm -hmm. of, of some pedals that I was, uh, had some, some ideas about um, and that has grown, that partnership has grown all the way through um, to today when we're heavily um, using Fusion 360 through the manufacturing extensions, five axis um, machining, part alignment and, and inspection. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's, it's grown with us. And you're a very young but growing company. Presumably when you start any business, there's, you know, there's some headaches financially, isn't there? So did the subscription model help? Yeah, oh, it certainly did. Um, we'd looked at uh, other um, solutions in, in the past um, and they were um, hugely expensive. So we were able to, to start with, um, with Fusion um, at a very low cost. Um, which enabled us to, to prove things out and, and, and get making things really quickly, um, unlike uh, some of the other providers which would require multiple thousand pounds investment up front before you even start. In terms of the Fusion 360, you know, what elements do you use? Um, so the, we, we, um, we design on paper um, and naturally we, we transfer that into um, 3D CAD models. Um, we use the, 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 the CAM element of it as well. We started to use the FEA um, uh, environment um, uh, also, um, but primarily it is the, the CAD and CAM element of it. More recently, um, we've progressed on to um, using the machining extension um, where we're able to utilize um, simultaneous five axis uh, as well as part alignment and quality control um, which has been hugely beneficial, especially with our latest um, product, the STEM. The, the, the SWARF toolpath has enabled us to do a, a wonderful chamfer because on our, our latest product, um, the, the STEM, we looked at uh, trying to, to ball nose this um, chamfer here, but with the machining extension, we actually, um, the, the toolpath is a simultaneous five axis um, uh, approach, um, which is significantly faster. Um, and the surface finish has been um, 
flawless. It's absolutely yeah, there's flawless. no cusps, is there? You no, can see it's it's, a, it's really nice. It, you know, we were able to sim um, simulate it on our um, on, on the PC first before we started uh, cutting, which is always a, a positive thing to do, um, and it works an absolute treat. Any other advantages of the add-on? Um, well, the, the part alignment element is, is really important. Um, it's enabled us to, to make sure that, especially from a second op perspective, um, our, our parts are aligned correctly to the program, um, which has reduced um, mm -hmm. cost, and it's also um, enabled us to have uh, simplified uh, fixtures as opposed to going to um, bespoke custom-made fixtures, which we'd have to do um, by subcontracting, which would have cost a a lot of money. Uh, I, I got a quote for about £5,000. And you've also got world-class machine tools here. Clearly, we need the software needs to drive something. So if I was to come back in a number of years or months to come, you know, what, what's the future hold? How, how is this business going to scale? Well, um, we've got a, a number of products that are in development, which is uh, really exciting. Um, we, we are looking to move within the next year. Um, and with that move, will enable us to increase our machining um, capacity and capability. We're looking to bring um, other um, machine tools in in house. Um, ultimately, we want to control mm. as much as we we possibly can, which is really important for our sustainability um, goals. Um, we're able to keep an eye on everything um, and making sure that we're able to produce products that are carbon neutral and uh, and, and and great for the rider. Mm -hmm. And for the engineers watching this video, most people would have heard of Fusion 360. But what would you say to people that haven't quite taken that next step to engage with Autodesk and learn out more? Well, I, I think it's a, a an incredibly capable piece of, of software. Um, it, it, it enabled me to go from my back bedroom to, to where we are today with, with two five-axis machines. And the, the, the capability is at the moment far beyond what we're, we're doing here. It's an incredible piece of software that is really good value.